I'm Sharon from Kites. Hi, and I'm Cecilia from Kites. And today we're going to talk about some pre-writing skills. Yeah, so we've got a lot of things in our toy box to help with pre-writing. Um, so we'll just go into a few that we could do. So first of all, we've got our Magna Doodle here. Um, so with these sort of doodlers that we have, this is pretty straightforward. Um, obviously, we're doing some writing. Um, with our little Magna Doodle, um, starting out, you know, with something simple, like maybe just some organic lines, um, and then maybe going into some more specific shapes. So the cool thing about the Magna Doodle is you can do the little stamps on here. It's very easy to erase. It's a good way for us to just doodle as much as we want without mm -hmm. any mess. Mm -hmm. um, and then Sharon here, she's got a little piece of paper that's got some sort of pathways on it. So. We could do different things with this. We could trace it with our fingers. Oh, a fun thing to do. I drove my car. <laughs> <laughs> Is we could use a little toy car. It doesn't have to be a car. It could be a little animal. We have a little bunny hop along the path. Boing, 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 yeah, boing, boing. there we go. So we have some straight lines. Um, we've got a curvy line, some little dots that they can hop to. So um, that's a really good way to kind of get those fine motor skills in the fingers working before we start writing. Yep. And you could turn it that way and you could do up and down and just add the language to what you're doing. You can even say curly, dot, dot, dot. Not too much, just single words to highlight, comment on what the children are doing. Yes, um, and then kind of in relation to that, um, this is sort of like the Magna Doodle, but this is called an Aqua Doodle. So this is in our pre-writing box here in the toy box. So this one's really fun because you use a pen and some water. And so you can draw um, using water instead of a usual writing utensil. So if your child's very motivated by water aqua play, this could be a really good thing to use. Um, and then lastly, we've got these little stencils. So these are some vehicles. Um, so it's kind of faint, might be difficult to see here, but you can see that we've got cars and then on the front of them, it sort of has a little shape. So if you put a piece of paper on top, then what you could do is take a crayon, piece of chalk, um, and you can just sort of draw on top of the piece of paper and it draws the shape basically. So you're kind of doing that rubbing motion, which is good for pre-writing. Um, and also you're getting something put onto paper, which gives us that satisfaction that writing does. 